An ethical sovereign stands on ethical grounds. An ethical sovereign stands on ethical grounds. Legal does not apply. What law of ethics have I broken with my choice of behavior? If none be broken, the one that stands before you claiming you are subject to some law has no standing against you, no jurisdiction. I am sovereign, and you have no jurisdiction here. I will be happy to be subject if you prove that I am. No consent, no proof. These responses you might give that one, but still, it's the bullying that is the problem. That one may be armed with the idea that somehow his or her bullying is okay. And that's where, in the beginning, we may have to capitulate under duress if the bullying removes us from our crowndom, home slash life. Counteroffers and questions are the rule. Do not answer any questions at all. I will be happy to answer that if you prove I am subject. I will be happy to engage you in this court if you prove that I am subject. I'll give you an hour to provide proof and then I am leaving freely. In the beginning, we ethical sovereigns will face these issues, and diplomacy will be a valued skill. We are sovereigns talking to sovereigns whether they know they are sovereign or not. We both expect from and offer to others ethical behavior. And should we choose unethical behavior, we are liable for ethical consequences. We are no longer sovereign when we choose to break the three laws of ethics, any or all of them. We are beholden to the ones we wrong. Then, through agreement by those who care, we are subject to any ethical bond, even if applied through the legal system while it's still there. Many do not know the three laws of ethics. They are not taught, though they supersede any legal consideration. The three laws are... 1. Do not willfully and without fully informed consent hurt or kill the flesh of another. 2. Do not willfully and without fully informed consent take or damage anything that does not belong to you alone. 3. Do not willfully defraud another, which can only happen without fully informed consent. Outside these things, it's a matter of taste. Our children cannot be considered fully informed, and we who care will protect them. Family first, and others who care if that is not an option. The best way to protect our children is to teach them of the dangers and how to handle them. Like the trap of the legal system that they do not have to consent to. Ethics, which a functional society upholds, without most being ethical, most of the time, a society could not function, stands above all legal claims. If it's legal but not ethical, the legal is null and void. If it's ethical but not legal, the legal is null and void. We, ethical sovereigns, stand on ethical grounds, choosing all behavior ethically. And for all who choose to be ethical sovereigns, I invite you to take membership in the Society of Ethical Sovereigns. For more, see the link in the description. Written, voiced, and produced by Amaterasu Solar, Shill for Humanity. Love always. Humanity will win.